Wing legend, Coach Neil from Black Dog Coaching. And this morning, while I'm out and about, getting my morning walk in, dogger. Just wanted to touch on uh, motivation versus discipline. Um, and this sort of uh, this comes from the fact that if you scroll through Facebook and every time you see a post to do with fitness or a post to do with nutrition or a post to do with changing your life, any of that sort of crap, everybody talks about motivation and just get up and do it, just do it. The problem is that motivation is only temporary. Uh, willpower is only temporary. You can only force yourself to do something for so long. And this is where discipline comes in. In my opinion, discipline is nothing more than a well-structured habit. So let's use training as an example. So for most people, the thought of getting up at sort of 4.30, 5 o'clock every morning to train for an hour, two hours, you know, before the sun's even come up, before going to work for the day, most regular people find that thought almost repulsive. The thing is, though, when it comes to managing your time, especially if you are working full-time or you've got, you know, lots of kids to look after, those early hours of the morning are probably the best time to get any sort of personal stuff done. It doesn't just have to be exercise. It could be your meal prep, could be education, reading a book, studying, whatever the case may be. Those dark hours of the morning when nobody else is awake, when your phone's not going off, when there's no distractions, they are the best time to get your shit done. But the problem is, you've got to get up early to do it. And people just generally do not like it. Now, you look at January, January, every January after New Year's, everybody gets motivated for a brief period of time, but then the excuse matrix starts to kick in. I'm too tired all the time. I'm too sore all the time. I... You know, whatever the case may be, the excuses kick in and then the training routine stops, the diet stops, whatever it is that people committed to doing in January pretty much comes to a complete and utter stop. And that is because motivation is temporary. The way to get around this is to build discipline as opposed to, uh, as opposed to establishing motivation because it's only temporary. Morning. Hey, get down. <laughs> So the way that I do this is you need to establish a habit. It takes time to establish a habit. In, in regards to getting up, I'm going to use getting up early as an example. So for me, when I first started dragging myself out of bed at sort of 4.30, 5 o'clock every morning, it sucked. It still sucks, especially during winter when I know it's going to be dark till fucking 7 o'clock in the morning. But here's the thing. I set my alarm for whatever time I set it for. I stick my alarm out of reach so I physically need to get out of bed to turn it off. Once I'm up, I turn on a light because the second light hits your eyeballs, it sends a message to your brain to say, "Rightio, it's time to get up. It's awake time now. It actually, it has a chemical effect on your body that triggers being more awake. So I get out of bed to turn my alarm off. I get a light on straight away to help wake me up, get my training clothes on. I don't think about it. Get some water in my neck, smash a brew down my neck, do my morning armor up for guys who are in black dog coaching. That's basically our morning routine to set us up for the best possible start for the day. And away I go. And it's not always easy. It's sometimes it sucks. Sometimes I have zero fucking motivation, especially if I've had a late night the night before and I haven't gotten to bed till, you know, 11, 12 o'clock, so I've been up working and I'm still rolling out of bed at 4.30, 5 o'clock to get my training done. There's zero motivation and it's fucking balls and it's dark and it's cold. But I've done it for so long now that it's a habit. All I need to do now is maintain that habit, and that's where the discipline comes in. Once I'm up and I'm moving and I'm doing it, I feel good, and I feel good for the rest of the day. Once I've finished it, I feel good because my body's flooded with endorphins from training. My mind's clear from my morning breathing exercises and meditation. I feel fucking great for the rest of the day because I've taken the time to get up and get that done first thing in the morning. So, guys... Motivation versus discipline. Motivation is good, but it will only take you so far. Start to use discipline to establish the habits that you need to change your life. That's all I've got for this morning, guys. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. Coach Neil, out.